today we are saving presets on Epson Edge Print. Open the software and look at the top left menus. Click the Tool menu and then go down the Manage Preset. Click it and the Manage Preset box will pop up. Click Quick Sets, then hit the plus sign with Add at the bottom. A secondary window pops up. Here you will name the quick set you are making. Here is where you change all the settings you want for this preset. Change the media name from fabric to rigid and make my print quality seven passes. Now, in layout, you can ensure the graphic fits the media width or the image is mirrored when printed. Click the color settings tab and check give priority to the embedded profile. Your new saved quick set will now appear below the built-in preset. Press the blue check mark with the default labeled under it, and the check mark will move from next to the new highlighted quick set as so. You can close out the window and you have just set your new default preset. Let us delete the current job or project in the job list to double check that our preset default has changed and works correctly. You will be able to first see the difference in job info when you open or add a new job or project. We now have two items in our job list and can check to see if your preferred settings are there now that we have just opened new images. Click on one of the images to display the menu tabs to the right. Job info will display first and will display the default quick set that was set. Click basic settings to check that the preferred settings display first in the menu now. Check color settings to ensure the check mark is in the box to give priority to the embedded profile. In job info, you can view any other quick sets that you may have saved but not made the defaults. With the secondary image, click on it and go over the settings again to ensure that Epson Edge Print is set on your preferred defaults. Thank you for watching. For more content like this, please like, share, and subscribe.